Hello everyone and welcome to AOB Canada. Today I will show you how to create a customer invoice with Sage 50 Canadian edition. In my next videos I will show you other interesting things through other and various accounting softwares used here in Canada like QuickBooks, Acomba, Advantage, Expansion, MyUB Accounting Plus and Zero. For the moment, I will show you how to create a customer invoice for items and services. We go to home page, we click on customers and sales, we click sales invoice, create invoice. We choose the customer, for example, we'll take uh, Future Electro Inc. Payment method, pay letter, cash, check, pre-authorization, debit, Tamex, American Express, MasterCard, or Visa. To simplify the example, I will uh, keep pay letter as the payment method, the simple one. Okay. I uh, will write the invoice number twenty. 18 11 55 invoice date November 1st November we choose the item for example uh, we will take uh, item number one Laptop Asus Transformer. The quantity is 15. The unit price will be 200. And the sales account is 4201. Laptop sales. Which is another item number two for example laptop SL Chromebook CB5 311T uh, 312T sorry the quantity is 10 uh, the unit price 25.0 here no discount Sorry, not discount. We choose desktop one, uh, number uh, four, I think, or seven, until uh, ten, thirty five, uh, desktop Apple. Emac TFT display at for example uh, 500 now discount given we go now to the printers item printers 20 HP Office Jet Pro 6970 all in one um, 45 the price 180 and finally we choose the projector Epson only 10 620 Okay, so here we have the subtotal, GST, and QST, and finally the total with taxes. We can see display sales transaction detail. Now we can take a look at the invoice. Uh, 
לפטופ, another laptop 10, Chromebook, desktop, printer and projector, the amount of each item, total of GST, the total of GST, and finally the invoice amount with taxes. Click OK. And we click on process. Okay. Now we will record, we will, uh, uh, sorry, we will uh, create customer invoice related to services and not to items. We choose network deals, for example. We write the invoice number 28 uh, 12 15 we chose the invoice number and we put here for example uh, 20 one in quantity here we write description of sales first of all we we write for example repairs sorry repairs and maintenance the price per hour is for example uh, 65 65 also the account will be 42 30 repairs and maintenance now let's go to the second one second type of revenue or income one if for example uh, we had spent five hours the total will be changed okay okay for uh, the second type of income training uh, we suppose that uh, uh, the total hours spent during the turni uh, training was 35 here training and uh, the price per hour was 95 here we will type 42.35 training. The last service was for IT consulting, only 10 hours. Here, IT consulting, sorry, consulting, 100 dollar per hour and the total is 1000 the account number will be 4240 now we can take a look at the sale invoice this is the invoice invoice date invoice number shipping to customer sold to customer here details uh, with description repairs and maintenance five hours uh, 65 dollars per hour uh, training also 35 hours spent during this training and we sold for one hour 95 
And finally, for uh, IT consulting, we spent, we sold 10 hours with 100 per hour. Is the GST and QST to combine taxes, one for federal government, and the second one is for COVID prevention. Okay. When we finish, we click on process. Yes. Okay. So this is the first way to create sales invoice or customer invoice. I hope that this video will be useful for you. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and to activate the notification alert in order to receive on time any video I post in my channel. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.